YouTubers and YouTubeettes, welcome back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe down below. Click that button because I make cool videos and I talk about amazing things. So come join the Tattoo Barbie family. But if you are a subscriber, the reason why I'm in this kitchen, military grade ugly wood kitchen i apologize for them i don't know why they put this ugly shit in here but i'm in the kitchen because i don't have time to do my normal setup because i have to go to work and I just don't have time to do all that but today's topic is going to be about tipping your tattoo artist why this is such a controversial topic in my comments i have no idea but apparently a lot of my subscribers y'all live in the uk area somewhere around there and y'all don't tip your artist there so this is for people in america because i don't really know the rules over there how much they charge or whatever this is just my personal opinion experience yada 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 you know what i'm saying you don't like it i don't care but Tipping your tattoo artist to me is very important. Before I was a tattoo artist, I always tip my artist. I just did it because they're putting something permanent on my body for my entire life. And as a tattoo artist now, I don't want to say I expect a tip, but it's just, it's kind of nice because you tip your waitress, you tip your barber, people in the service industry that are doing a service for you. If you can't afford to eat at a restaurant and tip your waitress, go to a fast food place. It's just that simple. Um, if you can't afford to tip your, you know, barber or something, I mean, I guess go to like, like a normal like Walmart where the haircuts are cheaper or something and I mean they just probably don't expect it I don't know I just feel like if you're in the service industry and you kind of you know you're doing a service for someone you should tip them and a tattoo I'm dealing with your blood I'm dealing with your skin your body odor you know if whatever breath you got going on um, I'm talking to you most of the time tattoo artists are like you know like psychiatrist, therapists, whatever you want to say. So I just feel like it's kind of just like an unspoken thing. But apparently people just don't tip their tattoo artists. Now, every artist is different, like I always say. But some artists don't get that entire whatever they're charging you for that tattoo. They may have booth rent. They may have to give a percentage to the shop every day. It all depends on where that tattoo artist works, what their situation is, whatever. But um, people ask me, how much do you tap? How much do you tattoo an artist? How much do you tip an artist? Now, I would say minimums, like if you get something small, like 10, 20 bucks. Um, anything less than that, just don't, just keep it. I, it's whatever. But if you're getting something big, like an $800 tattoo or something, you know, tip like 100 bucks, something like that. I mean, they're giving you a piece of artwork that's going to be on your body for the rest of your life. It's not just, I mean, shit, you tip your waitress and she's bringing you food that you're literally going to shit out in 24 hours. Like you're paying her for a temporary service of your stomach and shit. So <laughs> I'm just saying tattoos are permanent. I just think it's a courtesy. That's my opinion. I don't understand why it's just so hard for people to grasp. I just think, just tip your artist. It's simple as that. This video is really short. It's just my opinion. I just feel the need to address it because so many people in my comments are like, I don't think I should tip my artist. Well, I think you should. It's just a common courtesy. You're getting a piece of artwork. They're taking their time. They're putting needles in your body. And you're going to have it forever and ever and ever. So if you like this video, give me a big thumbs up. Like I said, subscribe down below. Follow me on Instagram at tattoo underscore Barbie underscore because that is where I am the most active. And that is, you know, where I post pretty pictures and I have my Instagram story and stuff like that. So, yeah, um, hope you like this video. If you didn't and you still don't agree, I really don't care. You can chime off in the comment section and let me know once again that you don't understand it. So, until next time, I will see y'all beautiful people later. Bye!